question it is necessary to peruse the ss constitution and the 2018 leadership structure and then record a finding as to whether the 2018 leadership structure is in conformity with the constitution of the shiv sena thus i have taken a comparative look at the 2018 leadership structure and the shiv ss constitution and have arrived at the following observations and conclusions a 2018 leadership structure mentions shiv sena paksha pramukh pramukh into bracket president as the highest office of the sspp however the ss constitution however in the ss constitution the highest office of the shiv sena political party is shiv sena pramukh but the said constitution distinguishes highest office and the highest authority and provides that rashtriya karyakarni is the highest authority whose decision shall be final shiv sena constitu ss constitution provides that the members of the rashtriya karyakarni shall be called as shiv sena leaders and provides for a total number of 19 members out of which 14 are to be elected by the pratinidhi sabha and the rest of the five members are to be appointed by shiv sena pramukh however the 2018 leader structure <coughs> envisages only 13 members in the rashtriya karyakarni out of which 19 are to be elected and the remaining four are to be appointed ss constitution provides for a total number of 21 deputy leaders out of which 17 are to be elected by the pratinidhi sabha and the rest of the four members are to be appointed by shiv sena pramukh however the 2018 leaders structure envisages 33 deputy leaders out of which 21 are to be elected and the remaining 12 are to be appointed the 2018 leadership structure provides for three categories of office bearers is a v secretary samanvayak and sanghatak however the constitution of shiv sena provides for three categories of office bearers with a v president sar chitness general secretary koshadhyaksha treasurer from the observation recorded in the preceding paragraphs it is evident that the 2018 leadership structure is not at all in conformity with the constitution of shiv sena in view of this finding alone it could very well be concluded that the 2018 leadership structure which is not in conformity with the constitution of shiv sena cannot be taken as the yardstick to determine which faction was the real political